Hi, I'm G. And I'm Michelle. And we are the, the Bin Pickers. Pickers. How are you guys doing today? Good, good. No, good, good, good. No free drinks today, so. Yeah, no free <laughs> drinks. <laughs> so we're sober. Okay, so here we are. And believe it or not, we are back in Michigan. We are. So we did some backtracking. Yeah, because no we need. left, well, we left in Nashville, went up to Louisville. We stayed yeah. there. It was really nice. Um, and then we went back up to Indiana. Right? And then uh, we hit the bins in Indiana again since we were there. Yeah. And then, um, so we're going to show you what we got this time in Indiana. Yeah, we had to hit the bins because it was like, okay, let's just see how it is again. Right. Was We it... want to make sure before we make, right. make the Because we're kind of leaning towards that. We were really leaning towards St. Paul, um, which we really liked there. Yeah. But Indiana, okay, the stuff might not be as good, but it's way cheaper to live. Taxes are way cheaper. Income tax is way cheaper. Just all these things. So we're kind of leaning towards Property Indiana. tax, way cheaper. Yeah, Indiana. Houses, way cheaper. I mean, you we know, can get a huge, huge house. Huge house. So we'll see what happens. But we're going to show you. So this is just another yeah. haul video of kind of what we got in Indiana. We thought we did pretty good. Okay, again, not super high dollar items. We, this, but we didn't spend much time, though. It was in and out pretty fast. We didn't. And they have so, a rewards card. Did we talk about that already? I think we did. Oh, okay. Talk about the rewards if you spend twenty dollars, you get ten percent off. Yeah. But I haven't done that yet. I have. We hadn't spent twenty dollars in one trip yet. Yeah. So we're gonna go through this stuff fast. Okay. Cubs, Chicago Cubs, Bud Light, just a vintage hat. It's I probably it was, from the eighties because it's like neon. I thought it was kind of cool. It's kind of cool. There was. It was fun to go through hats. Yeah. Polo, Ralph Lauren. But it's Indiana University. Or University of Indiana? Yeah, mm. you know, whatever. I don't Forget. know which one. Then your vines. This Picked other one's up. probably better because it has USA flag. Picked up two of those. Not too bad. We didn't look them up. I'm not sure what they're worth. But at 99 cents a pound, they're good. Yeah. Uh, women's performance, they're just padded cycling pants. Or they're like pedal pushers, like capri yeah. tights. They're tight fitting. Kind of cool, so we picked them up. This, just a lightweight Columbia. XCO yeah. jacket. You know, and how much does that weigh? Half a pound? Maybe a little bit more. Yeah, this is probably not quite a pound, but close so to a pound. So we don't have a dollar in it, right? Yeah. I mean, and if I can sell it for 20 that's pretty good. Yeah, not too bad. This is Victoria's Secret, and it was brand new. New with tags. Yeah. We were surprised. We got quite a few new a attack of, stuff. A lot of new attack Oh, and then I got to tell this story. So my daughter and I are looking at a bid, and then we see, like, somebody had popped off tags from, like, all this Athleta stuff, Patagonia, like, Nano Puff Vest. What else was there? All these, like, well, name brands. I'm like, where are the clothes for this? Well, I saw a whole bunch of tags, too. I so don't maybe, know that someone just took the tags off, So maybe right? somebody donated? I don't know what, what it was. I don't I know, but I was like, there. you know when you see the tag, and you're like, where's that item? I want that. Just Adidas shorts. Sorry, I'll stop talking. There was a bunch. We got, not a bunch, but we got quite a few bra. And I'm not going to say it, because she always says I say it wrong. Kasik. So I'll let her I say I think it. we both say it wrong. <laughs> I can spell it when I'm listing it, right? Just uh, Nike. They, they have a little Pants. bit of wash wear, but we can pair them with like a top or something. Under Armour? Again, so much Under Armour. Yeah, a lot so of Under much. Um, Zara, just Zara Basics. But it has hot air balloons on it. So again, these novelty print ones, you know, people like hot air balloons. They might be looking for I thought us. this was really cool. It's vintage. It actually has a date. Uh, 1985, Indiana. It is totally 80s. I mean, you yeah. would see, like, in a movie, people were wearing these kind of, like, jersey mesh bottom tops. Yeah. I think that might be pretty good. There I was lots really of know. vintage stuff. Yeah. Well, people there don't really get the vintage <coughs> stuff, so I like that. That was a thing, like, I noticed there wasn't, like, vintage pickers. No. And every other bin that we've been to, or that, not necessarily been to, but where we've lived, yes. there's always been a lot of... Vintage pickers, vintage pickers yeah. yeah. Adidas Climb Climb Light. Light, like tights, they're kind of cute. They're like really the cute. style of them, I mean the pattern of them. We like exercise stuff. I love exercise stuff. So Pearl Azumi. But this is, they're shorts, but they have the built-in padding as well. So it's like two in one or something. And I would guess, I don't always get, the, get them, but this yeah. is a full... And they're some, big, bigger yeah. size, so... Grateful Dead, unfortunately, this is a little kid's. 
Uh, like you blue. small, but it's 1997. But some people, some of know, these are are really those. good, but not as good as with the kids. <laughs> but I did get a Grateful Dead. Um, it's not a kids; it's size large. So I mean, what some year of these. Was it? 97. Was it 97? This yeah. one? No, this one was 90. Four, 94, I'm sorry. It's pretty cool. The only thing with it, it does smell. It smells. I need to wash it. It smells yeah, like smoke. Yeah, so we have to keep it separate, and then we'll wash yeah, it. I'm going to keep that separate. But, I mean, that might be worth 100 bucks. I don't know. I'm not sure. You know, even if it's worth 25 bucks, yeah. it's like it's still a good deal. So this is vintage. This is like 70s, I think. Look at the tag. Yeah, like made in the USA. It, and it's, yeah, 70s, 80. Notre oh, Dame. Oh, Notre Dame, yeah. And some of these Notre well, Dame vintage hoodies look pretty good. Well, we looked them up. They weren't this old, and it looked like they were pretty much all sell, 25 35 Yeah, like consistent seller. That's like a good thing. You know, when you're looking something up and you see, something. you know, even if it's not super high dollar, but they are all selling, that's a good thing to get. Yeah. Nike Thermofit, just women's Thermofit. <laughs> Mini Bowden. It's cute. A lot of people really like the mini Bowden stuff. So I don't get can... a lot of kids' stuff, but... But if it has design on it like this, we'll usually get it. Some of the Hannah Anderson stuff, stuff like yeah, that, that I pick up too. Yeah. But not a lot of it. This, I don't know what these were. I don't think we looked them up or anything. We didn't. Real Legends. But they have a fish on them. So they're like, you know, they're the kind of pants that I like. You know, they zip off. Yeah. And usually these, I mean, fifteen, twenty, sometimes twenty five dollars, yeah. depending on the brand. And some I'm of them not are sure good, these... and these might be better or not. I I'm not really I sure. Don't really know. Miss Sook. Just a. Uh, I thought that was black when I got it. The lighting in one of the Goodwills, it's on Shadeland. It's really dark in there, like back towards the back. So it's kind of dark. It's hard to see. I like that bin better, I think, than the other. That was definitely the better bin that we went to of all four of them. Is that shade? It's kind of crowded though and stuff. It is, but More so than we the got others, better but, stuff. Yeah. More under uh, just Under Armour. Some shoes. These are those like Alleg Allegria. Is that yeah. what it is? They're like nurses' shoes, but these are a little bit different. It almost looks like but a tennis shoe. Shiny. They are shiny, like rainbowy shiny. But pretty good, right? Yeah, there was another one. They were actually much cooler than that. They had the rainbow on it and they had the strap. I only found the one. I was really bummed. Under Armour. It doesn't have the tag, but it's new. It has that on it. And this this stuff was ninety nine cents a pound. Yeah. Shoes are a dollar seventy nine cents a pound. Yeah, I hate that. I don't like that. I know shoes should be cheaper, but Adidas these are men's. Golf. Just golf pants, yeah. More Under Armour. Compression. Do a tag MPG. Just work out, right? Under Armour. Under Armour. I hope Lots Under Armour still sells. I mean, we we it's haven't not sold. It's good, but we haven't sold for quite a while now. But uh, hopefully, it still sells because we got a bunch of it. So this, he always gravitates towards this vintage stuff, <laughs> always. And sometimes I do good with it, but I don't always. Um, this is 1987. But it says something. Drums. Music, Treasures, Richmond, Virginia. I don't yeah. know what that is. I don't know what it is either. It's 1987. Some people love these vintage shirts. And sometimes I have a problem telling them. So These are keen. Keen. They're just slip-on. Um, they're cute, right? I mean, 20 bucks. Yeah, so we'd pay $1.79 a pound for the shoes. These actually look pretty good. They, they just need like a little bit of wipe off because otherwise they're pretty clean. They're Nike, what does it say? I don't know. Luna Repic Flyknit 2. I don't know how to say that, but that's yeah, what they sure. were. They're women's size 10. They look mm. pretty good and they look nice. I mean, they just need a little wipe up yeah, on the edges. Not too bad. Yeah. I mean, some of them look really good that were that. You can just shut that door. I'm sorry. Okay. I think. <laughs> sorry, we're just. Here we are again in hotel with everybody. Yeah. <laughs> um, Valley Batiks, a 2X. So it's a hand-painted resort wear. Some of the dresses look pretty good. The 2X, I'm sure, will be much better. Yeah. Has beading on it, but 25 bucks, I'm going to guess. And we never, well, in California, we didn't get much vintage stuff. No, there was lots of there vintage There were so pickers. many vintage pickers. But here, there was tons of this stuff. I mean, this is like 80s. Right? Yeah, Purdue, pullover. Purdue. I don't know. Yeah. 
Hummer. I'm, I'm really excited to get this stuff listed and see. Like, well, I'm, we, I'm like what, ready. What are we going to do when we list this? I don't know. Like, so you got to look it up. If we put this on like $25 by now, and I mean, is that what we do? Know. Or we, we might, send this out to auction? We might reevaluate our whole business model I when, think we, when will. we get situated. Because we were doing, we also always used to do auction, and then we went to mostly buy it now, like 95% buy it now. So I'm not sure if we're going to continue that or if we're going to do auctions again. We have, have to, to we have to just go with the flow, so I think we're going to have to mix some things up and do some things differently we'll than what we used to do. Yeah. And we'll figure that out when we figure out where we're going for sure. So. <laughs> yeah. This says uh, Indianapolis Motor Speedway. And it's Nike. It's Nike. Yeah, I thought it was kind of cool. It is pretty cool. You just, I don't know, yeah, I didn't look it up. some but... fuzzies on I didn't look it up either. But... <coughs> Excuse me. Lululemon. I don't know what it says on it. I don't know either. But it actually had a teeny little hole by the logo, but I still got it. Yeah, because what is it, like 25 cents? 50 yeah. cents? Uh, these are Tommy Bahama. Just board shorts. I never really seen Tommy Bahama like that. Not quite like that, no. This is the cat's pajamas. But it's sushi print. So I looked it up. Some people put them on buy it now, like cheap, and they sell them. But then somebody sent a shirt out to auction. It sold for $52 out right. to auction. We got the whole set. So we got the whole set. Yeah, they're cute. I mean, people like sushi. Yeah. They want jammies like it, right? I guess so. <laughs> I don't know. Bra. Nice bras. We got some nice ones. Freya. Strapless. But these, like, somebody didn't wear Freya, these very often. Not strapless. Freya. Not strapless. Not strapless. Our pile's getting really high over here that you're stacking. New Attack, Victoria's Secret. Love so that. So two New Attack, Victoria's Secret. We were, like, again, like, we're kind of surprised. We got some pretty decent stuff. Bill Rogers. This is vintage. This might be 70s. Yeah, I'm not sure. Boston, or early 80s. So, and then it has, like, reflective. reflective. It has vented. I'm not sure. It was lightweight enough. We got it. Some of the vintage stuff is good. Some's not. So, Indianapolis Colts. So it's by Reebok. It was new. NFL team apparel. I picked it up. It's a lightweight jacket. I got this bra. It was nursing. And it is size 48H. I don't think I ever seen a nursing bra that, that big. big. So it's I'm pretty like, big. I'm gonna try. I know, that. like, oh, nursing bra, but I mean, it's hard to get well, nursing bras first of all that are bigger, and then to get one that is a bigger size like this. I mean, that's probably worth you know twenty but bucks to the right person. I to guess. the right person, you're only gonna have so many people that are gonna need that. But. Delta Burke, eighty-eight dollars, size twenty swimsuit. I'll take that stuff all day. Yeah. Not I thought this was so cool when I got this. It's so cute. Chicken Little. He's so cute from the Disney store. And he looked like people are selling him now for $25. Hopefully we can get yeah. some stuff listed in the next, maybe next week, the week after. Uh, I'm not sure. Know. I might have to hold stuff off till next year. Probably not. We'll probably sit on this for a whole year now. But but if we get a big enough area in our house, we can start storing up again. Like, we didn't have that room in California as much, so... At all. We didn't have that room at all in California. But in Indiana, we could get that kind of room. I mean, the house yeah. is... Like a five-bedroom house with a full-finished basement you can get, so... Right. That sounds pretty good. And it would be nice to have all our stuff in the basement. Like, everything would be in the basement, so it's not in your living yes. area at all. And then we can live, obviously, on that. And then, like, levels. you know, obviously, Minnesota... It's more expensive. You can't get quite the same house, but the bin's better. So, you know, we still got a little more figuring out, but we pretty much narrowed it down. We're getting close now. And maybe uh, I can be like Indiana and then ease into Minnesota. Like Indiana, maybe. get used to a little bit of snow or a lot. I'm so not sure. Pendleton, well, we didn't even get this stuff in Oregon very often. It was hard to get because people know, like they pick right. that in Oregon. No one even there. picked these up. These are like the blazer-like things, right? Yeah, wool. I mean, they're not like, yeah, they're wool. They're like a shirt jacket, but it has these fancier like buttons, wood buttons on them. Yeah. And we got, and these didn't have holes, right? Because we no, there I was one with holes, and we threw it back. Yeah. But these looked pretty good when I looked them up. Yeah. 
And these are actually still like, they They're feel nice. really nice. Yeah, three oh. of those. And then I picked up actually another, just a regular shirt. I mean, and again, they're not as good as they used to be, but... Surprised to find still... Pendleton in Indiana, though. I know, I mean, right? I know. We find it a little bit in Oregon, but not very often. We didn't find it really much in... Uh, fresh Produce 2X Linen. Yeah, it's because it was... She liked it. So we 2X, got. I picked it up. Uh, Champion 2X. It was new with Tag. I'll take that. Champion C9, which just is from Target. This was just Field and Stream. I don't always pick that up. Had fish on it. We got a whole bunch of other men's, you know, shirts. like fishing shirts. So. so when I go to list, like get back into the swing of things and list, we have tons of men's shirts. Yeah. So I can sit down and, you know, bust out 50 men's shirts real quick and then have 50 things on and they're all shirts. And it's super easy to list those things. So it'll be great. We can have that all. We might not even have to live by a bin because we picked up so much stuff on the road. Seriously. That we might not even need a bin. <laughs> this was just another fish, but it was uh, hook and tackle. I'm not familiar with it, but I'm like, nah, I'll pick it up. This was new with tag, made for life. Which they're just from Kohl's, I but believe. But they're 2X. Yeah, but they're like mm. a workout pant. Yeah. I don't know if this like light behind us is too bright. Sorry if it is. Our lighting, mm -hmm. you know... Being in hotels, this is what happens. But we're back at this motel that we were at before, and it's so cute and homey. So, anyway. Marathon? Nike Golf? Yeah, we'll still get them if, even if they have something, usually. Well, it depends on what they say, but Marathon right. is pretty... Yeah. Um, whatever. North Face? Men. Shorts? Men. I'm surprised the men's stuff that we've been getting on this trip. Because we stuff, usually... Though. I know, yeah. new. Because this was 2X, and it was Nordstrom Rack, right? <clears throat> Or Nordstrom or something? I don't know. Nordstrom. It says Nordstrom. $58. Yeah, oh yeah, 2X. What's it called? Sejor? Sejor? I'm not sure. Hmm. Sorry. And of course, we're all sick too. Talbot. <laughs> extra large. But I looked this up, like these Talbot. Okay, so when I found all those tags that were ripped off, there was a bunch of Talbot's tags. And like, it had to have been these because this is like crispy and everything. But it's a Pima Cotton. It says the Talbot's Tea. I looked those up. I mean, people consistently sell them for $12, $15. So. This is another Champion 2X. This one didn't it, have a tag. It feels new, it? but it doesn't have the tag. Yeah. This is, I'll let her say it because she always Pro. says I say it wrong. Never heard no. of this brand. No. How do you pronounce it? Icky Cools. Uh. Icky Cools. No I'm, idea. I'm it's like sun it. protection or something. Is that what it is? Oh, I looked it up. These looked really good. Yeah. We got a skirt too. It didn't just, we? I didn't see no skirt in here. No, there was like a skirt. Maybe. It just, it felt cool. So that's why I grabbed it up. And this is one of the tags too that I found. Torrid. Just a Torrid big bra. 40 D D D. Um, what's this? Fenrite Mason. It's just 100% wool, like open front cardigan. Okay. It was cute. It had a hood. Another bra. Cassique bra. These Cassique bras, the bigger ones, are usually pretty good. Eileen Fisher. Just a tank top. Nothing yep. fancy. Oh, is this the other? Yeah, this. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, this is. No, this is different. Ick. I Wait, you're right. I it is different. Cool. I got it. So what is that? I be cool. This is ICI cools. But it looks the same. Hmm. Huh. Is the RN know. number the same? Wait a minute. I feel like this is weird. One, five, two, a three, five, six. A different RN number. But look at the, like, can you see? They're like the same. Let me same. show you this one. So then that one. I don't know. She thought they were the same. But <coughs> Guess not. So maybe neither one of them are good. I don't know. Well, here's another fresh produce. So you can yeah. put those two together. This is 3X. So. Oh, is it 3X? Uh-huh. This is pure gel, extra large. Just t-shirts, yeah, but they don't weigh much. Yeah. And there was a whole stack of these ones, so I got them. That's so it. that is a lot of the stuff we got. I got some other stuff. I'm like, I got so much stuff. I can't show it all in the video, but I showed you most of and it. And I would say we were probably at the bins. There was different. We only hit two bins, didn't we? Maybe we hit three. I think we hit three bins. But a total of maybe two hours, right? I would say two to two and a half hours. With all the kids. 
That's what we got. Yeah, so I think we did pretty good. With I all was the kids. like, man, that that that'll work for us. I mean, we can do that. And if you can get in your game, you know, if you're like, you don't have the kids, you can get in your like picking game and you can really, I think you could get some really good stuff. Yeah. Because I didn't feel like there's that much, there wasn't as much competition maybe, except right. that one on Shadeland. But anyway, yeah. we thought we did okay. And we if I could it. live close enough to the bin that I could go every day or almost every day, like I used to do in Oregon, I think we could do great there. I think we could do good in Minnesota, too. We're still considering that. We haven't completely ruled that out, but it's a lot more expensive, and we can't get the same house that we could get in Indiana. So we're still trying to figure it out. We come to Michigan to just kind of take a little break, figure it out. So and, we uh, might, um, we'll probably head back down to Indy, maybe check it out again, look at some houses, and really see what we can do. Well, we actually looked at a house in Indy. We did. We, when we were there, we went and looked at a house. And it was like 4,000 square feet house. It was huge. It was awesome. But there was it a, needed a lot it of work. It did need though. a lot of work. And so we're going to see. We're going to see what happens. Yeah. So, we're so we'll keep you guys posted and, on that. Uh, yeah. We'll let you know. But we wanted to show you, like, I mean, we thought we did okay. I'm not sure our estimated how much money. I think that's pretty money. good. Not super high-end stuff like we used to get. But this stuff sells faster and easier. And for less. And we'll be so, ready once we get back into the swing of things. We'll be ready to just list. And we have a whole bunch of great stuff right. to get out there and hopefully start just pumping it out again. Yeah. But we got to get a house and have a have an address. <laughs> That'd be nice, right? I'll tell you, 21 <laughs> to 22 days, however many days it's been that we've been on the road. It's getting long. It's been huh? a long time, yeah. Wow. So it's nice. We actually... Um, Came back to this little motel and the kids were like, ah, you know, it kind of feels like, oh, it's familiar. We know it. So it was yeah. kind of nice to come back and we can relax for a night. And Yeah. Okay. okay. We'll okay. keep you posted. Um, that's what we picked up in Indiana. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for all the nice comments. And if you could like, comment, subscribe on this video, that'd be great. Yeah, I saw a lot of you people said Indiana, Indiana. There was some people said Minnesota. Some people said <laughs> Texas. Know. Things like that. We didn't even probably, go to Texas. Probably not going to Texas. So we just have to pick from what we've gone through. Yeah. Um, then, so, yeah, we'll keep you posted. <laughs> yeah, we'll let you know. Okay, thank you guys. Pick outside the box. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.